Hi, I'm Amber. I'm Ashley. And I'm Caitlin. And today we're going to be answering the three questions. So question number one, what is your role as the nurse for providing care to a critically ill patient? Some of the responsibilities of the nurse include assessments, medication administration, monitoring, and communication. Um, so I also said like making sure that we're doing our assessment and figuring out what's wrong with this patient. Um, communicating with other people in the care team um, and also advocating for our patient. My biggest things would be um, definitely monitoring and reporting any type of change in condition as it's happening in real time. And the second major thing would be communication with not only other team members and doctors, but with family members as well. Question number two, in your professional role as a nurse, how will you demonstrate effective communication amongst the interprofessional team? I will actively listen to the client, use communicational styles such as focusing, restating silence, and active listening, and I will also use nonverbal communicational styles. Um, I said just asking questions if you're confused as the nurse about like their condition, if the patient is um, questions about them, um, they can also ask the in being open to questions. Um, explaining it in different ways if they are confused. Um, S bars are really important because it's short and it's a, in a precise way to um, communicate within the team. Yeah, bouncing off of communicating with the team and furthering on my first point, um, just communicating in real time and as quickly as you can with uh, providers if there's a change in status, um, just being open and available for the family, using your active listening, verbal and nonverbal communication skills. And then question number three, what are your expectations for working collaboratively with other healthcare professionals? Some expectations that I have are working collaboratively to care for the provided patient in the simulation. Um, I said make sure you have a respect for each other in their profession. Um, again, being open about questions if you're uncertain about um, something that's happening with the patient. Um, and communi communicating everything that involves that patient to everyone in the care team so then we're all on the same page. Yep, uh, patient-centered focus would be the biggest thing. My expectation would be to care for that patient to the best of my ability, um, which involves a lot of communication between the interdisciplinary team. Okay. 